Hi, everyone. Back, everybody. It's Joe here from Data Analytics Ireland. So, hope you keep well. Um, today, we're going to talk about how to need a set of keys from a Python dictionary. So, in our, my, our previous video, we we're talking about uh, deleting an individual key. This is about deleting um, more than one key. There's probably a lot of similarities, to be honest, um, but I want to just take you through it and show you a way to quickly achieve it and incorporate it into your data analytics projects. So I'm going to start off um, just introducing you to, we need to create an empty dictionary. Um, so the whole idea about the empty dictionary is that it basically adds the values uh, that we are going to show you now in a second into the dictionary and then actually the dictionary is created. So we're starting off an empty dict one here on line three, okay? And that's just basically an empty dictionary. And how you add values to a dictionary, it doesn't have to be empty or otherwise, is you basically call the, uh, the dictionary and then within the brackets you say the name, which is the key value, and then the value, oh, sorry, yeah, it's the key, and then it's the value, whichever you want it to be. So in this instance, we're putting in one, two, three, four, five, six. We're putting in six different sets of <coughs> keys um, into this empty dictionary, and basically then we're gonna print it. So here's the print statement that we use, okay? So that will just basically, when I run this logic below, you'll see in a second, that will basically just print out six different key value pairs within the dictionary. And the whole idea of this, an object of this video is to show you how you would uh, delete uh, values from that dictionary. So once we have that created, so the first thing we need to do is create a lookup list. So the whole idea here is this lookup list is going to be used in the logic below to say these are the values we want you to remove from the dictionary. These values and these values only. So what I've done is create an object here I think called dictionary remove. Okay. I'll just cancel that. And within that, I'm basically saying these are our values that we want you to look up. It's a list, basically. And um, basically that's going to be referenced now in two seconds in our logic that we're, we've built to show you how to do this. So there's two ways to do this. Um, first one, uh, if you've looked at our previous videos, is the pop method. And essentially we're just going to use a loop. I'm um, actually using a loop for both. So, you know, it's pretty straightforward what's, what's going on, but just to give you options, uh, we're going to show you both. So I'm going to use basically key. So the key is basically for any value found in dictionary remove, which is here, okay? We're basically saying empty dict one, which is these values here. I'm using the method to pop. We're basically, find, um, you take that key, whatever that key is, so in this instance, be key five or key six, and remove it. And then what we're basically doing is we're printing it out. So after basically this scenario, we'll be left, so we started out with one, two, three, four, five, six, in keys and value pairs. This is actually removing um, values, key, key five and key six, okay? And then what we're doing is, so remember with this logic as well, as we move along, empty dict one now is, does no longer has key five and key six. So all that's left is one, two, three, and four. So when we move on to use the del statement, what we've actually done is we've redefined dictionary remove but with separate, different values, okay? And basically we're saying now remove key three and key four, okay? And then we're basically using the loop again, except for this we're gonna use the del statement and basically, um, basics tells us to go and look at empty dict one and then find the key, the key, key for every key value, which is in this instance to be three and four, and remove it from the dictionary. And then again, we're going to print it. So the whole idea now is we start out one, two, three, four, five, six, between key and value, key value pairs, we move five and six, so that leaves us one to four. And in this instance, it's we're now in with this scenario, we've actually removed three and four. So, in actual fact, now what we're left with is key value pairs one and two. So let's print this, just have a quick look at the logic. You will see it down here in the screen. And we have run this here. Okay. And that should come in a second. Right, so perfect. So what we've let, what we started out off is, as I said, we started off with keys, all the key values there. So key two, key one, three, four, five, six, right? So that's all them. So that's literally the dictionary here, this here being populated with these values. That's how you would add them on, okay? And then this is the print statement. Then we've just, as you said, at the start, at the outset, we've defined this dictionary remove in the first instance as our lookup list. And we've removed, we've, in this scenario, it's basically taken out five and six. So when we look at the next print line here, 
that's this this line here and essentially we can see that five and key five and key six are gone which is correct so we're left with two one three and four perfect and then in this del statement we've then removed three and four and again we've re we've done that as part of the loop and then we've actually gone and removed it um, so when we've reprinted it we're left at one and two so there are some examples if you are in an interview exam interview and people ask you a question about how would you uh, well in this instance you could show how you would add a values in but actually the purpose of this video is how you would remove values from the dictionary and as i said we use the pop method or we use the del statement and they're just some very straightforward examples of scenarios you obviously can produce your own if you want but these will just show you a way to, to, to show it and articulate how you can do it so that's in essence how you would delete a set of keys from a python dictionary i hope you've enjoyed this video today thanks for coming along if it's your first time please subscribe and hit the alert button for our next video come along we've more coming out soon uh, regards interview questions and techniques and we're getting to the end um, of the dictionary questions so um, please, as I said, hit the subscribe button. Thanks for coming along. Take care and see you soon.